A brief hello before the long goodbye. Steven Gerrard arriving for training this morning, but also to confirm the end of an era. Gerrard! In the fickle world of football, Gerrard has been that rarity, a one-club wonder, Liverpool for life, captain and cornerstone. But at 34, he's announced this season will be his last at Anfield. In a statement, he said, this has been the toughest decision of my life and one which both me and my family have agonised over for a great deal of time. Saying goodbye is going to be difficult, but I feel it's something that's in the best interests of all involved, including my family and the club itself. At Anfield, where Gerard has been a towering presence for so long, fans paid tribute. Really gutted, but I feel it's the, probably the right time for him to go, as long as he doesn't do a Frank Lampard and go somewhere else in England. Best days are behind him, you know, and end of the day he's been a great servant here, so don't blame him really. He's getting on a bit, so uh, yeah, he's, he's had a good run with us, and uh, I'm sure he'll be back for coaching or doing something else with the team. The statistics speak for themselves. Gerard has played 695 times for Liverpool over 17 years and scored 180 goals for the club, helping them to win 10 trophies, most as captain. He was still scoring yesterday, twice in Liverpool's draw with Leicester, but with first team opportunities now limited, many believe he's made the right decision. I think um, he's been Liverpool's best ever midfield player. I think the second best player Liverpool's out after Kenny Dalglish, um, but I think probably the time is right. Gerrard famously won the Champions League in 2005, but never the Premier League. A rare regret, but his status as a Liverpool legend is undimmed. Soon to be gone, but surely never forgotten. Andy Swiss, BBC News, Anfield.